Hey guys, what's going on? This is Mike, and in today's video, I'll be showing you how you can downgrade your iOS 10 device back to iOS 9.3.2. So this is if you are on iOS 10 beta, uh, because iOS 9.3.2 is still uh, the latest public release. Uh, this won't work when uh, iOS 9 stops being signed by Apple and iOS 10 is public. So just keep that in mind, this is only for uh, if you have iOS 10 beta installed on your device. So here I have my iPhone 6s plugged into iTunes here. Uh, it is on iOS 9.3.2. I'm just going to walk you through the steps uh, to exactly how you can do this because uh, I've done this multiple times before. I know exactly how to do it. So uh, plug your iPhone into your computer. Uh, if your computer says trust this iPhone or your iPhone says trust this computer, uh, just hit trust so the connection can be secure. Uh, make sure that everything that you would like saved on your iPhone to be saved. So either send it to another device or make sure it's backed up in the cloud somewhere because doing this downgrading will completely wipe your phone. There's no way uh, to get to a previous version of iOS and uh, restore it from an iCloud backup. Uh, unless of course you downgrade to iOS 9, uh, 9.3.2, then you restore that version and then you uh, restore from an iCloud backup. But uh, there's no way to go directly from iOS 10 beta to restoring your device to an iCloud backup on 9.3.2. So now we've gotten that out of the way, let's begin. So once your iPhone is plugged into iTunes, hold the home and power button on your iPhone for 10 seconds. Make sure your phone is unlocked when you do this. Now after 10 seconds, release your finger from the lock button and just hold the home button. Uh, then, if iTunes is not already open on your computer, uh, it's gonna a pop-up is gonna say iTunes has detected your device in recovery mode. It must be restored until you can use this with iTunes. Hit restore, and then it's gonna show the most recent version of iOS. In this case, 9.3.2. Then just hit restore. Then the I, then the uh, IPSW is gonna download, and then it's gonna install. The whole process takes about uh, 30 to 40 minutes, depending on your internet connection. And then uh, that's how you can uh, downgrade back to iOS 9.3.2. Uh, again, I'm sorry I couldn't show you uh, on here because I already downgraded my iOS 10 device a couple days ago. But the process is really simple. Again, just put it in recovery mode by holding the home and power button for 10 seconds. Then keep holding home until iTunes detects the iPhone in recovery mode. And then just follow the prompts and until your iPhone is completely restored. Uh, anyways guys, hopefully that helped if you're stuck on iOS 10. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a big like down below. Also comment telling me what you thought. My name is Mike, and I'll see you in the next one.